Okay, we're gonna do the tag now. So I'll ask the question. John will answer, and then I'll answer. <sighs> and then you guys will do the same thing. How and where do we meet? Boat camp. But really, it was on the airplane. I gave you my almond Snickers. That was after. That's our first that real was interaction. That was in school. No, it wasn't. Our first interaction was in boot camp. With the eye. My pink eye. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, I always forget that one. She had pink eye, and she tried to self-diagnose, and that was not allowed for a sailor to self-diagnose themselves, even though anybody knows you have pink eye. Like, I have pink eye, and they're like, nope. So I had to, I had to ask her. I had to say Kalia. Well, I had, I had to say Lowry. What are your like symptoms? That's all you can tell me. What are your symptoms? And I was like irritated eye. I said yeah. You just said like irritated eye. Oh no, I said pink eye, and then you yeah. kept like trying to probe me. And I was like, okay, well, say irritated eye. Yeah, that's. And then she would, on her way by me, sometime oh, yeah. me hold the door because I was I'd a girl like, guard. She'd say, Shreve. I don't know why, but I thought she was flirting with me. I wasn't. I don't think I was. And then one time we were sitting across from each other at the cafeteria while she's kind of like kitty corner and she and her friend Tomlinson were talking and there wasn't a whole lot of laughing going on in boot camp hardly at all but Kalia always made sure that she was the loud laugher and always had a great smile when she and her friend were talking so I uh, enjoyed seeing that and I remember saying to myself she has a really cute smile. She's really Did pretty. You really? Yeah. I remember her hair was almost similar to this a little bit a little bit more uh, curly, but that's kind of like her hairstyle she had, and she got in a lot of like, she got a lot of talks so too. But I remember I was also like, wow, her hair is really pretty. She's a really pretty girl. And I also remember one time she had to carry the microphone into the microphone oh, yeah, in the I middle, struggled. and she couldn't do it. She could not do it. They almost had to switch me out. I also remember but I was determined that, to carry that choir, mic. me and the guy named Alibi were like, we were waiting. It was like literally, we were we had, we performed like three times. Did you say? We performed like for the class before us, another class before us, and we, then we finally performed for ourselves. We like performed for three weeks straight. Remember that? I don't know, not for other people. I don't remember performing for other people. Remember because sister division was all in charge of flags. Well, anyhow, we were the singing and the band and stuff, right? The other division was not band and stuff. They were, they were flags and whatnot. So, anyhow. I remember we just like stay there and we perform and you know we were up there in the choir room just talking. And I think she came over and Alibi and I were talking. I think she came over and was like talking to us like. Oh, so good. I think I remember She's that. She's like a little social butterfly. And I was like, I don't know who this person is. But then yeah, then the, the airplane was really when we first really talked though. Like actually spoke to each other and I gave her a, an almond Snickers and she's like, thanks because I had eaten all the chicken. And she's like, thanks. Well, that's because. He said, he didn't tell me it was an almond kind of snicker, so then I was forced to try to eat it because I didn't want to be rude. That's a long answer. It is, because you kept going on. Okay, so yeah, I agree. I won't, if you get it right, then I won't. Okay, go. Um, how and where was our first date? I think it was to sushi. Yeah. She doesn't like sushi, but she tried it, and it was like kind of like a group date, I'd say, kind of thing. I suppose it had to be. We went to the mall. Yeah, it had to be, but we went to the mall too, and... Sushi. Yeah. I think that's about it. I, have I think it was for her birthday. No, well, that's when we started. You asked me out, like officially, like the day of my birthday. Or day of my birthday. <sighs> what a great birthday present, right? Next. We already said that one. The first kiss. Um, what was your first impression of me? You kind of answered that. Just a few words. You want to sum it up? Cute, but loud laugh. My first impression was he was really tall, and. He was nice, and he had a deep, uh, deep singing voice. Because I think you were singing bass. Um, also, I was really weirded out because, like, the first time that we like had like an actual like non-stressful interaction, where like you know just like a normal talking interaction, was like in the airport going to Pensacola, Florida, and he so. disappeared. And I was so weirded out. But I'm like, why would he just disappear? And I was like looking I for I didn't him. disappear. I was in the TV room where they had the lights off and I had passed out. He disappeared and people were like asking me because they thought we were like besties or something. They're like, oh, you were hanging out with him. I'm like, where is he? I was like, I don't know. I'll go find him. Um, and I didn't know any of this. 
And so I was like looking for him, and then later on he like showed up, and he said he was sleeping, and I was like, Yeah, it sounds like me, right? I fell asleep in the TV I was room. Like, what in the world? I am true to myself, though. I still fall asleep in the TV room. So that was my first impression too. It was just like I don't know what this. Guy. <laughs> oh yeah. Um. When when, when did you meet my family? I met you guys. What year was that? It had to been the year 2016. The year we got no. Oh yeah. <laughs> the year we got married. So 2015 in May. I think literally when we got married. No, we were there for a couple of days. Yeah, before. but it was the time of our marriage. Though. Yeah. Yeah. And me for her family, her mom, same thing. Met her mom first time ever, and Tracy, first time ever. Wedding day. Her dad was later. Yeah, Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. That next Christmas year. Um, how did you know I was the one? You just know. I don't know. I just know. We got along really well. I don't know. I knew he was the one in when we were like dating in a school. Because I was like, I really just, I really like him. And Oh, I do have a better answer. Well, I was just like, I really like him. And he was just so nice and spiritual and just really sweet. And he was like a, a friend, like my best friend. And I was like, I knew that I was like in love with him and that he was the one because I was like, even if we don't actually end up together, because I was like crushing on him for a while. Um, I was like, even if we don't end up together, I still like want him to be part of my life. I knew she was the one because one day I said something really mean and stupid. <laughs> Not towards her really, but just like towards like the possibility to be a like, boyfriend girlfriend mm-hmm. since I'm like I don't want it to be a fling I want to you know not really tie down myself plenty pretty much is what I sea. what I said and I said plenty fish in the sea there's plenty of them I, I just don't want to like you know tie myself down to you as only, his arm much, was wrapped you know? around me but then she's like okay well let's just be friends and whatnot right like okay and then I realized like this kind of sucks I'd rather be with her every single day of my life that's because I treated him literally like a friend but yeah, I was like, I don't want to be treated like a friend. I'd rather be treated like a, more than a friend. So, yeah. That's when I knew. I was like, oh, I think I probably should just make this more of a thing. That's just dating. Nah, that's not the one for okay. me. Mm. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's the same question. How long have we been together? How long have we been together? We've been... Six-ish years. Yeah. Um, okay. How do you resolve problems? Like, between ourselves, if we are, like, arguing and whatnot, like, we'll argue and argue and oh, argue for a while. Oh, oh, okay. I'll and um, we'll just, like, I think we'll have to be quiet for a while between ourselves, and it's, like, one of us will come in, and if it's Kalia, she'll come in and be, like, hi, John, I just really wanted to say. <laughs> when you said that, I just, I say that a lot. I just want to say. And then me, it's more like, babe. I'm sorry, that's stupid for what I said. Like, I just want you to know I really love you. I just want you to know. Or you'll do something sweet, you know. You just give me that face of, like, and this is the same face that Ada gives, like, when she's been in trouble. Like, she's in trouble, and it just looks so, like, oh, it's okay. <laughs> and then, uh, it's not between ourselves, it's, like, a problem that we're having within, like, together on a certain subject. I'd say we talk about it a lot. Kalia is very more like, I'd say emotionally sometimes charged with things, whereas me, I'm more like, that doesn't make you know, like logic, I guess. So we kind of pair up it's pretty well. It's like we well. agree to disagree, and then we come back, and then we're like, oh, we actually, one of us will agree with each other. Yeah. Person. Or we can kind of sometimes compromise a little bit and figure out together what it was. Okay, sorry. What and do we you never go to sleep angry. Think. What do you two do for a living, and are you using your college degree? Not using a college degree, either one of us. We're both in the Navy. That's an easy answer. Yeah, they know that. What key elements make a relationship and marriage successful? I think I said one of them was compromise. It's important. Oh, you're just going to constantly beat heads together. And And I would say, and this is something that I learned later on in our marriage was that it's more, impor- it's more important about how the person feels 
then who's right or wrong, right? So if you have to take that out and be like, okay, I'm sorry, it's, you know what I mean? Like, I just don't want to fight. Like, I, I love you. You know what I mean? Like, it's not important. That's better than being like, but I'm literally right, or you're wrong, or you did this, or you did. You know what I mean? Like, instead of casting blame, just choose the loving that person. Um, what do you love about me, Julia? <laughs> oh, wow, you're really zoomed in there. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I love John's kindness. He is the most genuine, kind person I have ever met in my life. He's just kind, naturally a kind-hearted person. I don't know anyone else kinder. Well, actually your mom and Chambra I mean I think you're you're like that too but your mom definitely I would say your mom more than John actually <laughs> but that's what I love about him my turn what do I love about Clea <laughs> hard one I have to really think do you really have to think <laughs> there's a lot of them that's why just her blurtiness. Susan which means she's a, that means she's a black nerd. Um, her good motherly Okay, instincts. you're doing a lot. You're just supposed to say, like, name and one thing. her just... wonderful smile and laugh. Thank you, babe. Oh, how do you keep a relationship healthy in life? This might be something that Brianna would not like to hear, but... I She's think everybody here. knows this. Having good sexual relations is important, I think. <laughs> and I would say I would say intimacy, not necessarily just Okay, sex. yeah, that's probably better. I would say intimacy, like holding hands, hugs, kisses, um, soft touches, being close like I'm sitting on his lap now. Feeling smushed. And um, just intimacy, like pillow talk, laying in bed and just talking. Uh, places you want to travel. Ireland for Kalia and Africa. Ireland, Africa. I would love to go to Oh, you're going to name for yourself? I'm sorry. I didn't know oh. this was about yourself. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm supposed to be naming. <laughs> okay, sorry. Um, John would like Just to name go. two. John would like to go. Well, yours is the same. Is it? You Ireland and Africa? Not Africa, but Scotland. You've been to that. Yeah. Oh, um... Jamaica and what's that other Jesus. island? What's that other island? You did not name the main one. Oh, that's on the tip of my tongue. That's an island. You talk about it a lot. She don't know. What is it? It's so embarrassing. I'd like to go to. Scandinavian countries, Norway. No, there is an island that you were That's talking about for a long time. No, I have not talked about any island. Yeah, you were like, oh, I want to go vacation there. I would like to go is to Norway, to Finland, Finland, and what's it, Sweden. Those, I'd like to travel those. That's been like a dream of mine for like at least the last four years. Um, I would also like to visit You're just thinking now. Jamaica. Yeah, that's a good one. I don't know. Where are we? Children, how many do we want? We both said two, but to begin with... I said five. Kalia said five, and I said four. Because we were like evens and odds. She was like, odd oh, numbers. I was like, no. It's fine. Favorite color? Your favorite color is... Brown. Brown? It's an awful color. Is that not your favorite color? Did you say that your favorite color was the color of my skin? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Her favorite color is pale. <laughs> <laughs> well, now you're being facetious. No, your favorite color. Come on. Kalia's favorite color is green. Yeah, I'll take it. Brown was your answer? Red? 
I don't really have one, so that's a hard right question. I do like black, but it's not really a color. Brown, black is a color. only on people. And I don't like brown, like, oh yeah, I like that brown carpet. So what is it then? I don't know, I don't have a okay, don't have green, one. blue, that's it just why I depends didn't know. on what that's it is. That's why I didn't know. Favorite food. Clea's favorite food is... What is it? This is a, like, interesting one. Barbecue. Uh, I don't know. That's not I, a lie. That is the truth. She loves some that. ribs. She can put down some ribs. No matter what time, if she finds some good ribs, She she's, like, in love with them. And she'll go back to the restaurant the next day because she had some good ribs. Like, for instance, we just had some good ribs at a restaurant. The next day, she's like, I'm really craving some of the same restaurant that we just had yesterday. That's not a lie. That's the truth. What is my favorite food, though? What food do I, like, I have to have all the time? Ribs. Baby. I will, like, go and get Chicken. this. If you go to the store, I will ask you for this. What? Chips? Fruit side. That's a candy. That's not a food. That's a candy. It's candy not That food. is not a... No, that doesn't count. I'm, they're talking food. They're not saying what's your favorite sweet. It's what's your favorite treat. Okay, what's your favorite whatever. candy. Okay, that's, John's... That, that's a whole different thing. Maybe, okay. John's favorite food is um, Asian. Oh, we're talking about cuisines? He likes sushi. I do love sushi. Loves, that is like my like comfort food. And... You know what it is a little bit? It's because it's like kind of expensive, so it's like kind of out of your price range when you go get it. But it makes you feel better because it's like, well... You love sushi. I, I splurged on myself a little bit today, you know? So. Yeah, ice cream. He really likes ice cream. I've become a little bit more of an ice cream person. That's correct. And okay. hot Cheetos. Ooh, yeah. That's, that's a good um, one for Good job. Favorite sports team? Chiefs. For me. You don't have one. You don't, an- you don't let me answer? Okay, I'm sorry. Why do you have to answer the question? I forgot how <laughs> this works. But you don't have one. She likes... The Chiefs is not a good example. She likes the Jayhawks better. Mm, that's true. That's true. Because it doesn't really say college or um, professional, so... You don't have one. Oh, I don't. Seahawks. Ooh. The Cheehawks? Seahawks? The Cheethawks. You don't have one. The Cheethawks. Is that it? Why are you saying Cheethawks? Nope, you're wrong. I would say if I did have a team, which as the closest thing to my favorite team would be, would be the Broncos. I don't know their players like that, but if I were to watch a football team, they'd be the Broncos. Anna, what are you doing? Anna! Are you sharing chips? We don't share chips with Bubber, okay? Yeah, he's too small. Good idea, though. Okay. Yep. Okay, next one. What is my favorite TV show? Mine, babe. What is my favorite TV show? Uh, Altered Carbon. No. What's your favorite show? That's not it at all. Um, I didn't even watch that all. You don't have one. You don't have one. Oh my goodness. What? He doesn't even know me anymore. What's your favorite TV show? I don't know. I don't really don't think I have one. Kalia's favorite TV show is... <laughs> Are we watching something that just went on? <laughs> I don't know what Kalia's favorite TV show is either. She likes a lot. Maybe what is my favorite TV show though? Anna the E. No! Charmed. No. What was my favorite TV show? That's a river. No, no beat. My favorite TV show, baby, before it ended. Hey, stop touching things. Jeez Louise. Supernatural. Scandal. Oh. Well, that's a lying TV show. No wonder I didn't know it, guys. Oh, and John, I won't see his favorite TV show. Anna, get off of me. Someone help me. Oh, prison break. Ooh, she got it. That was a pretty good one. Prison break. That's a pretty good one. That's it. And also. Yeah, that hurt. You pinched me. Anime. You gotta pull it up again. It'll go out of it. He really likes anime. Yeah. Um, favorite movie? Ooh, that's actually true, because I'd say one of my favorite TV shows would be anime. Uh, um, called My Hero Academia. That was a really good one. Um, and the other one, what were, the, um, Full Metal Alchemist. Brianna, watch Full Metal. It's a good one. You need to watch it. Uh, you're not in here, Brianna. Chambra, if you, I know you don't like, oh, I can't talk to you about anime. Chambra, darn it. Uh, okay. Okay. And 
That's gross. Tongue. Bring yeah. your tongue off. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What food do I not like? That should be an easy one because you don't like a lot of things. But what thing do you like? Ooh, no way. Well, you don't like sushi, like real fish sushi. It's not a good one because I don't like. Or rare cooked mm. meat. <laughs> or rare cooked anything. It's a food, baby. It's not like how it's cooked. I don't know. Mushrooms. Okay, let's go. <laughs> and then John. That's a hard one, yeah. There's nothing. She's I got a hard one. Like, uh, it's not entirely true. Okay, a food that he doesn't like is the Brookside. I bite me. <laughs> That's not true either. I, I didn't mind it. You can eat the rest of them. Bite me. No bite me, please. Don't bite. I'm going to get mad. Liver. I don't like liver. <laughs> you ever see me eat liver? No. That's but why. This is not random. Okay. What is my favorite type of sandwich? She likes a club. <laughs> or a BLT. She can eat a BLT too. I think she likes BLT a lot, actually. Yes. And John, he likes tuna sandwiches. A certain way, it has to be specially made, though. And he also likes to try meatball sauce. You've gotten them. that a couple of times. Like, I like to try them, but it's not my favorite. But you always, like, try them. Ada, I want you to leave those, please. Please leave them alone. Can you open it? No, no look at it. Open it. And Papa. Leave them alone. You want some more, Papa? Um, yeah, I, I just stay with the tuna. You know, that's a good one. Okay. It's a long one. We need to hurry this up. Come on. Eat, okay, if I could eat one thing every day, what would it be? Chocolate. Brookside. Okay. Here's the hot cheetos. Yeah. What is my eye color? Not stupid. <laughs> Normal your eye color. Who is my best friend? Your best friend? Would be me, but if you're talking about somebody other than me, be Smith. Uh, you're Smith. What is something I do that you wish I wouldn't? Oh. Bite your nails. Really? That's the only thing I think of, but you'd be wrong. I don't even really bite them that bad. That's because it's not really a thing. Like, I, that's just the first thing that came to my mind. Yeah, what I do I wish you, Okay, I wish you wouldn't tear yourself apart so much. Because you're actually really beautiful and you always think you're not. One thing that you do that I wish you would do... Sleep so much. Oh. No, I don't mean that. Because I know that you're tired. I don't wish that you wouldn't sleep too much. It just... It sucks. But I wish that you wouldn't have a nest on your side. I do. I like to have a nest. I call it his nest. But it's because I grew up with a very big like dresser next to my bed so I just piled everything on my dresser. Now I don't have that. I have a little round table and it's taken up by my diffuser that we never use now even though I got a, we got Kalia that. You know, we got Kalia these nice things and she just doesn't use them anymore. That diffuser we got her? It takes up my table. Oh no it doesn't. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> next question. Next question. Okay. Uh, Might ask what this up in two. What number are we on? 26. We're almost done. Oh, come on, then. Speed up. I have an itchy neck. What is my heritage and where am I from? Africa. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Dad. John. West Coast Africa. That's not wrong, is it? Western Africa? Yes, Western Africa. I don't know the exact name of the tribe or what is my What is my highest percentage of the one, the one little country, very small country. It's not Nigeria. Oh, really? Uh, you, you guys know Wyoming. And. Fire your finger. That's like Scandinavian. No, that's like 6%. Irish. There. Yeah, stick with Irish. European. Okay, next. 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 Um, did I play any sports? 
No, you didn't play sports. I did. I did track and field. Oh, yeah, okay. What did I, I play sports? I was cheerleading in middle school. Did I? You did basketball. Yeah. wasn't very good at anything, so I don't really count it, but <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna stop it if you don't know yet. No, I'm doing it! Guys, I'm sorry it's so long. If you bake me a cake, what kind would, it, would I like? Chocolate. No. White. Marble. <laughs> I knew that. And yours is red velvet. No. White. No. What? Cheesecake. <laughs> cheesecake? Yeah, what, what, is what is it? What is it? If it's not cheesecake, what kind of... Is it a cheese pie? Is it a cheese pastry? No, it's a cheesecake. Yeah, I do not do that. Get off my lap. Since you can't listen, get off. Stay right here. There you go. Ouch, jeez. What is one unique talent that I have? You can... Ina, you are really about to get... Braid your own hair. Out. No, yes. Yours is faces. <laughs> I didn't even look at you when I said that. <laughs> and Stacy. If you count the next. All the buddy. Weird habits of each other. Yours is faces. Weird habits. That is. Um, Kalia. Has a habit of starting a question and never finishing it for like five Go minutes. To see. She'll go. So I was thinking earlier today that we could. Uh, oh, I, and, and then John, a weird habit that he has. That, 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 John that. could literally fall asleep. Like, what's it called? Necrophobia. I think I have sleep apnea, so I'm always tired. No, literally, he'll be talking to you, and he'll be doing something on his phone, like his finger will be on his phone, and he'll fall asleep. Yeah. I can and, write while like, sleeping. While he's still holding. His finger's still on the phone. What? Okay. Uh, what do we argue about the most? I would say. Stupid things. House. House. Cleaning. Kids. Kids. Um, what is my favorite restaurant? Chick fil A. No. That place in Bates. Barbecue. Gates. I don't really have. Oh, Gates, yeah. I, I wouldn't really say I have. If you went to Kansas right now, you would not want to stop at Gates. I would go to Gates. Favorite restaurant. That's the way to figure it out. What about mine? Taco Bell? No. What is it? You don't even know. What is it? Okay, I might not. Okay, next question. <laughs> what can I spend hours doing? Reading. saying something too about it. Actually, now that you say that, I think you mentioned something about it. Like, the first time he, I think, actually said it, like, for real, I think, because we were by ourselves, like, an actual, like, cutesy thing. But he said it before we were even dating. But I think he was trying to say it, like, in a, I love you as sister, I, I sister of the church. I don't say that ever casually. Well, my my I loves you never come out casually because I don't use them. You were saying it casually though. See, like, she did not know me at that time. That was probably me trying to say like trying to be like more serious. She probably just didn't realize. It was like a hug. We we're saying goodbye, going our separate ways, and he's like, like he said he loved me. Like, yeah, I don't say that. And to I was people. like, oh, I love you too, brother tree. <laughs> okay, last question. I'm not getting you. Last question. Yes, it is. What is your most repeated oh, phrase or sentence? You know what I mean, it's please. You know? You know what I mean? Yeah. What is yours? You have one that like you do say all the time. I can't think of what it is. Similar. Yeah. It's not you know what I mean. I think it's something similar though, you know what I'm saying? That's gonna, that's gonna bug me. Yeah, me too. 
you know, that's a long video. Love you guys. Have fun with your video. Bye.